Hello there guys and gals, the Welsh Hunter here back with yet another title update for the DCF Studios game Cruise Brothers. This is title update number 4 and it's going to give us a wha 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 whopping 5000 G's and everybody loves it. It's back to achievement hunting baby, achievement season is in and DCF are providing us with plenty of them. So, another easy title update, but again, a very fun one. I really do enjoy this game. So, I'm loving the title updates they bring out. But, with this one, what we've got to do is... We've got to execute three special moves with three different characters. We've got to do um, a special move with four different characters. And a breaker move with three different characters. I'll, I'll obviously tell you exactly which ones we're going to be doing. Um, so, once we get in then, what we're going to do... Uh, as we get to the main story, provided of course that you've played the game and this is just the title update that you're doing, the first thing that we're going to do is go all the way right and heading to Brawl Knight. Brawl Knight. Yes, it's Brawl Knight. Um, O'Brien, of course, this is the only one that you can fight. And the first fighter that we're going to do is go for Azazel, who is on the second row, second uh, picture right there, Azazel. Now... Uh, the easiest way to do this, what we need to do is get beaten up just a little bit. Then we need to just press the A button to give some punches to O'Brien. So I just get let myself get punched just a couple of times, just a few until our health bar knops off. It knops off. Well, that's a word I just made up, but it's good now. So as soon as that happens, keep spamming the A button until you can see the bottom left corner. Just below my Welsh hunter sign there is the P1, as it says. You can see it just turned to an electrical heart. As soon as that hits the crown, as soon as the uh, as soon as that's full, we can press the left trigger when the crown appears and it starts flashing, like right now. Press the left trigger, you will do a special move, and that is the super. That's the first super. Now, the achievement will unlock straight away, as you'll be able to see. For some reason, a couple of achievements didn't actually unlock for me for whatever reason on screen, but it does unlock. So, going to the next one, we're going back to Brawl Knight. Of course, we've got four uh, to do with this one. And what we're going to do is select Diane Joe, who is on the second second row, fourth picture. Or the fourth uh, fourth one in. Dying Joe's got a fag in his mouth. So, um, I mean, if you're going to die, you might as well um, <laughs> you might as well beat the crap out of people as well. Ah. Yeah. Right, same thing then. So, let yourself get hit. Dying Joe looks pretty alive right now. I'll give him that, to be fair. And then, of course, just do the same thing. So keep spamming the A button. The likelihood is the more damage that you give to O'Brien, who, unfortunately, the uh, the American tattoo-wearing, loving guy gets gets his ass kicked in this one. But he will always have his special move first, since he's kicking his ass. But then, usually, we get ours. So you see the crown. Press the left trigger. As soon as you see the crown at the bottom left, that breaks his arm, breaks his leg. God damn. Damn, that shit looks like it hurts, to be fair. And that is the second <laughs> super done. Now you can just press start on the main menu and head back. So, third of all then, what we're going to do then is we're going to press A to continue and then go back to Brawl Knight. Again, we're going to be beating the crap out of the unfortunate O'Brien. Um, but this time we're going to be selecting Riley as our fighter. So, back to um, Brawl Knight. Again, apologies if the first sort of two videos there... Uh, the Sort of two, first two fights were a bit quick. Um, but we are going to be selecting Riley, who is on the second row, all the way over the right. The fifth option, again, with a cigarette in his mouth. God damn, that's some cool poses we've got going on here tonight. But of course, it is just the same thing. So you just uh, get yourself, let yourself get hit a couple of times, then keep spamming the A button. He, O'Brien, will beat you down with his special move, which will in turn give you his special move, uh, your special move. Um, also, you can do this if you're using this in two controllers, by the way. If you've got two controllers, you can also select versus mode uh, and obviously just do the same with the characters and obviously you don't get hit. Uh, but it is easy enough to do in single mode anyway. So, left trigger there again with the crown. Achievement will unlock immediately. I'm you. I'm me. And if you're a Simpsons fan, I'm me. You will know exactly what I'm talking about right there. So, that one's done. So, we can quit straight to the main menu. I'm me. Hey, 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 hey. And then we're going to go for the final of the uh, supers. 
Now, straight into Brawl Knight again, what we're going to do is select Miguel D this time. Now, he is all the way on the sort of bottom row, not the question mark, but he is in the middle right there. Miguel D, now this broski looks serious as a froski. Whatever the hell a froski is. I don't know, but it is something now. And of course, this is the last of the supers. So, let's, uh, well, let's just do this, shall we? So, as per usual then, let yourself get hit a couple of times. You might not even need to do that. You can probably just spam the A button. Uh, because O'Brien will always get his super inside you first. Wait, not inside you. That would, uh, that would hurt. Uh, <laughs> incredible, so. Uh, so yeah, just keep doing the same thing we've always been doing then. Spamming the A button. He will put his super noodle right where the sun don't shine. Bam, bam, bam. But again, that in turn will help us get ours. So press the left trigger as soon as you see the crown. And skablamo march. We are done. Oh, we are done with the super. Very loud. Very loud Miguel D super is. He didn't need to be that loud, bro. Anyway, for some reason, the achievement didn't unlock on screen for me. But it should have unlocked immediately for you. So again, just double check that one in case it didn't. But it should have. Um, it's easy enough to get the... Um, prerequisites, right. So, that should be Cruise Brother Z. Now, what we're going to do is start doing the breakers. Um, now, it's basically the same thing as we're doing. So, we're going back into Brawl Knight. Uh, and again, for the first night, uh, for the first fight against O'Brien. Now, we're going to choose Faust, who's on the top row with the Mohawk. Now, we're going to be doing the same thing, except this time... After we get the crown in the bottom left-hand corner, instead of pressing the left trigger, we, as soon as we get hit, we're going to press the left bumper and right bumper together on the controller to execute what's called a breaker. So we're doing the set again, the same tactic. So the Jurassic get beat boy for a couple of times. Or again, you can just keep spamming the A button and O'Brien will put his super noodles again where the sun refuses to shine. Which could be anywhere, anybody, I suppose. Right up your nostrils. Um, anyway, I'm just uh, going off here, just waiting for it. So let's get our ass beat for a sec. There we go. So when we do that then, wait until you get hit. As soon as you get hit, left bumper, right bumper. And then as, as long as you see the word breaker pop up, the achievement again should unlock straight away. For some reason, once again, it decided to not do that. So I've had to switch the Xbox off and try again. But that is how you execute a breaker anyway. So anyway, when we get back to it, the next character we're going to need to do is Mr. Mayhem. Now, you can't do it in Brawl Knight, so you've got to do it in Spetsfest. Champ 1 there, and Mr. Mayhem is on the um, penultimate row, again, in the middle. Now, for whatever reason, I had kind of... You can do this with one controller. It'll probably be easier if you do it in two controllers, and the only reason I say this is... Um, again, like I said, we'll be doing the same thing. So we're going to get hit a couple of times, and then as soon as you get hit... Press the left bumper and right bumper together when you've got the crown, when it, basically when you've got your special attack on the go. But there is so much going on when there is 2v2, and for some reason, and I'm going to show you now, uh, we end up, well, in fact, my, my teammate ends up kicking the one guy's ass, and then they start running into each other like an absolute pair of knob-headed donkey bags, uh, for whatever particular reason. And I'm just going to skip forward to it first, because I went through the whole fight, waiting and waiting, and they just kept doing this the whole fight. So, if this does happen, what I did, go behind him, press the X button to hit him. Um, because for some reason, pressing the A button didn't work. So I press the X button to hit him. And then, as soon as he hits me, then I press the right bumper and left bumper. And then the breaker worked. So, again, if they keep running into each other like a pair of absolutely spet nazis. Um, just hit him from behind with the X button or hit him from the front with the X button. Hopefully then he'll be able to hit you and you can execute Am's Breakerino. So, next, what we're going to do then is go with a secret fighter. So, go into Brawl Knight. Not career mode. Go into Brawl Knight then. Uh, now we need Kaviro. Now, what you need to do, Kaviro, um, on the top line, we're going to go to Faust. Again, is the guy with the mohawk. And then we're going to press X. So when we see Faust here, press the X button, and he will actually turn into Kaviro, who is basically the exact same guy, just with a different name, I think. So, eh, hey, whatever, whatever helps, it gets us the achievement, doesn't it? Uh, so again, make sure to press the X button there when you're on Faust. And then, when you're on that, you should, it should say Kaviro there, top left corner, 
and thankfully because we're in Brawl Night it makes it a lot easier. So it's the same thing once again. Uh, get your ass kicked a couple of times and then spam the A A A A A A A A A Alcoholics Anonymous A A A of course. We're gonna get our ass kicked again, super noodle style. Curry, curry flavored, hmm. prawn flavored. Bit of barbecue beef is a well, that's a good looking super noodle. Anyway, same thing then. As soon as you get hit, right bumper, left bumper, break of that butt, and oh, dude, that looked painful. But apparently, O'Brien, Americans don't die from gunshot. Whoa. whoa. Okay, well, I'm going to leave that one right there. Uh, but you should get the achievement anyway. Um, and then we've just got three left to do. And they are to execute three special moves with a certain amount of characters. Well, three characters we've got left now. So if you take a look, you should only have three achievements left. Called Wake Up Gangster, Lock and Load, and Target Locked. So what we're going to do first then is go with Igor Cruz. So we can once again just go into Brawl Knight. Uh, we're going to select Igor Cruz. Now, this time we're doing something uh, completely different. You, we don't actually need to hit our opponent. We just have to activate the three special moves. So, Igor Cruz is on the top row, third um, third guy along. Now, as soon as we, get, we begin, you've got to do this quite quickly for it to count. So, you press down on the D-pad, right on the D-pad, and then the B button. And that seemed to work for me. Um, so, again, but you have to do it quite quickly for it to count. So... Down on the D-pad, right on the D-pad, and B. So, do it quite quickly. Don't leave any sort of big gaps in between. And then, as long as you do that three times in the fight, uh, you will get the achievement. Very, very easy. You cannot... You can't complain. You cannot beat it. But again, so if it, if it doesn't work, just make sure that you're doing it quite quickly. So, so down, right, B, pretty much straight away. Make sure to do that three times. And again, fantastically and awesomely, we don't actually have to hit the opponent. Which always comes in hand for the next one, which is Trey Sorrow. Um, so what we need to do then, we have to go into Spets Fest again, because we he we can't fight with him in uh, Brawl Knight. Um, Trey Sorrow is the penultimate, on the penultimate row to the right. And again, it doesn't matter, you'll get some enemies, but that's fine. Uh, now for some reason, I... To be honest, at the time, I thought you actually had to hit the enemies when I'd done this the first time. Until I realised that you didn't. So, you can literally just start the fight. Again, just do the same thing. So, down, right, and B on the D-pad. As quick as you can. Down, right, B. Smash that out as quick as you can. And then just do that a couple of times. I find with Trey Sora, it was kind of hard to tell when you were doing his special move. Um, but as long as you just, again, quick as you can. Down, right, B. Or A, or X. It doesn't have to be B. I just found it easier for myself, to be honest. But it can be down, right, B, or A, or X. Doesn't have to be all three, which is all good. And there we go. That is that one done. And then we've only got one left. And we're facing off with the legendary O'Brien with his ultimate evil twin, O'Brien. Oh my god, it's like as American as it can get as we go to Brawl Night again. Um, the only thing that's missing is... Guns, barbecues, huge, massive McDonald's, and people shouting, FREEDOM! Yeah, you know what I mean. So, you see where O'Brien was there? Sorry, I just got a little bit ahead of myself there. But make sure to choose O'Brien, O'Brien. And again, it is just the same thing as we've done. Very quickly as you can, in a row, down on the D-pad, right on the D-pad, B button. Make sure to do this three times. Target locked. Oh yeah, my name is America. I am freedom and have guns and barbecues all day and I drink till I get all the goddamn achievements. So anyway, that is that. I'm going to stop talking in a crappy American accent now, but here we go. So that is the new title update then complete for Cruz Brothers. Thank you so, so much for watching, guys and gals. I do hope you enjoyed, uh, again, the title update. Again, it's, it's always awesome to go back to these games from DCF. Really enjoyed them. So thank you so much for watching. Hope the guide helped as well. Hope you tolerated the terrible American accent and stuff as well. Thank, big thank you to that. Again, big shout out to everyone who continues to support the channel on Patreon. Thank you so much again, guys and gals. I'll see you in the next one. Big love.